Firefighters are battling more than 55 major wildfires out west. Just take a look at the Beckworth Complex fire. This is in Northern California. It's just one of several blazes destroying homes and forcing evacuations. Fueling these flames, extreme drought and intense heat. Lilia Luciano is in Palmdale, California with more. Lilia, good evening. Good evening to you, Errol. Look, the heat is brutal. Where I am in Palmdale, north of Los Angeles, right now it's 106 degrees. It's bone dry, and as you can see, it's also windy. All of that together making conditions in the West perfect for devastating and also deadly wildfires. Wildfires in the West exploded overnight, forcing evacuations and turning deadly. Two Arizona firefighters were killed Saturday when their plane crashed while surveying flames. In Oregon, the bootleg fire is now the biggest wildfire in the country, and California's Beckworth Complex fire has doubled in size daily for the past three days. Extreme heat and drought are fueling the flames. More than 30 million people are under excessive heat warnings and advisories, with several cities hitting record triple-digit temperatures. <laughs> Washington and Oregon set new emergency orders mandating access to shade, water and breaks for anyone working outdoors after an Oregon farm worker died. Also distressing farmers, the heat torching their crops. We'll be down on the farm 20% in production across the board. Jeevan Brar and Paul Sangha in Washington are fighting against the heat to save their harvest. Their berries were nearly baking at one point, more than 120 degrees hot. It created a really difficult situation. How unexpected was this? This is probably the best growing year that I've seen. Personally, with this heat wave, I do the damage it did. It not only did it damage this year's fruit, but it also damaged the, the new shoots for next year. And there's a ripple effect to that. The longer this heat wave lasts, the more damage it'll do to future crops, not to mention the droughts it's prolonging and the fires it's fueling. Errol. All right, Lilia Luciano, thank you for that.